Hello, welcome to another tutorial for Open Buildings Designer. I am Ranit Deb, and in this tutorial, we are going to learn about HVAC airflow properties. First of all, we're going to go to Mechanical. Select the rectangular duct. If we scroll down, we can locate the airflow and status in the placement dialog. This is in fact taken from the active part. If we change the active part to chimney new, we can see the airflow is changed to chimney and status is new. Similarly, if we go back and choose mist return, we can see the airflow and status have changed as well. Now to create a new airflow property, we need to go to Dataset Explorer, create a new part inside the Ducks family. Create a new part by right clicking inside of the right side window, give it a name and description. Let's call it Chimney Return. Now let's assign a level. I'm taking an existing level here. Let's set the attributes to by level. Give it a thickness and height of 300. Apply. So chimney return has been created. Now commit the changes. Let's again select rectangular duct. Go to airflow and change the active part to the newly created chimney return. We can see the airflow and status have been changed. Let's place the duct with the active part. Changing the active part to supply duct. Next, if I open building element info for this duct, we can see the airflow is supply. If we check for this duct, we see the airflow is chimney and status is return. Now if we go to data reporting tab, open the schedules, go to duct rectangular, we can get the airflow and status data for the ducts in here as well. So this was HVAC airflow properties. That's all for this tutorial on Open Buildings Designer. Thank you. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you and see you next time.